Hello everyone, welcome back to our draw and dance sessions. This is session three, which is circles and eights. During the last two sessions, you've practiced straight lines for the volcano and curved lines for the Cronley Dong animal. And today we're combining circles and straight lines. And that's because when you're writing in your handwriting and forming letters, you need to make sure that you're really fluent with your straights and curves. So today is circles and eights. And to start with, we're thinking about the Cronley Dong. Imagine that the Cronley Dong has been taken into a forest where they've chopped down a tree and created a post in the middle of an open space. That post is going to be a sundial. And then the Cronley Dong takes a rope and creates circles and eights around the post to create four fields for everyone to farm in in the village. It's a strange idea, but you'll see what we do when we start to dance our circles and eights dance today. So we're going to start off by imagining that we are creating some circles to the dance. Watch it now. and two sticks to make a cross and two circles. This is to help with the circles and eights dance. You'll watch now and see how crossing that cross, which we call the midline, helps children to make a flowing crossed movement. the circles and eights onto a chalkboard and then onto paper. The children might need help with halving the chalkboard or the paper using a dotted line with a cross in the middle as you can see here and two dots either side. This will help them to cross the midline. Watch now as we start to draw our circles and eights. taking the circles and eights onto paper and again the children need to fold the paper into half, mark a small cross and two small circles to help guide them with crossing the midline. from the two wings that can create a butterfly or a dragonfly, we're now going to use the circles and eights to create a flower. Watch as the two circles move 
into four circles. You'll need to split your page into quarters for this one with four dots on the folds and a cross at the centre of the page. we've created a flower. We've looked back at the volcano action to create the leaves and the grass at the bottom of the picture. If you look at the next picture, here we've used the circles and eights to create a tree with hanging leaves or coconuts as eights. We've created a teddy bear completely out of the circles and the eights, a butterfly and even the clouds in the sky. You can be as creative as you like with any of the circles and eights shapes. Here you can see that the children could even use the circles and eights to create their own card, maybe to send to someone else in their family or their friends. We're going to watch as a butterfly is created now on this card using different colours. <laughs> mysterious four fields in the Cronley Dolls Wood. Make sure that when you do your right dance today that you hold that pencil or the crayon with a correct tripod grip so that your finger and thumb are resting the pen or the pencil on your other fingers. Also make sure that you're crossing the midline and trying really hard to get your lines to go on top of the previous lines that you've drawn. Have great fun creating your flowers, bears, butterflies and dragonflies. See you again next time. Bye bye for now.